Uh, good morning, everyone. Thank you for joining us today to learn how to vacation like a pro with Sandals VIP Experience. I'm Beverly McLean, Covington Social Media Director and Travel Blogger. We will also have some of our Covington Vacation Advisors joining us here on the line. Your microphones are going to be muted to prevent any background noise, so if you have any questions during the presentation, please type them into the chat box at any time and we'll address those at the end. Now let's get to the main event. Today our presenter is Ryan Stinchcomb. Ryan started with Sandals back in May 2016, and Covington has worked closely with him since he became the Business Development Manager for Virginia in 2017. Ryan has personally visited all of the Sandals resorts, both on the job and also stayed as a guest, where he received the full Sandals experience. Ryan lives in Richmond, Virginia, and on his downtime, he enjoys watching sports and working out. Welcome, Ryan. So glad to have you, and thank you for joining us. Um, I'm going to pass you the screen control now so you can kick us off. There you go. Did that work? Okay, you should have it now. Okay, Ryan, we see your screen. But I don't hear you. Are you talking? Okay, do we want to get started here? Okay, ready to go. All right. Beverly, I can't hear you right now. Um, I can't hear anybody, I don't think. Uh, we're hearing you just fine. Okay, perfect. So I can get started now if we would like. So welcome, everyone. I, I don't know, if Beverly, if you have anything to say and then you want to pass it over to me. For some reason, I can't hear um as of right now i don't know why the, the sound isn't working on my end uh we're doing fine we can hear you just fine okay perfect so we can we can get started so i just wanted to welcome everyone out this uh this morning to our virtual uh, vip experience with uh sandals resorts here i want to thank covington travel for having me this uh this morning my name is ryan stinchcomb and uh, today, I'm really going, going to be taking you on a journey. We're going to uh, walk through really that Sandals experience, what you can expect by going to any of our Sandals resorts. And then I will actually take you through the different resorts that we have to offer. Um, so you can have a chance to really see the different personalities and see what each resort um, is like and really uh, what they have to offer there for you. So let's get started here. So at Sandals, we are the world's leading the world's only five-star luxury included resort. So when you arrive to any of our resorts, we're trying to exceed expectations. We're constantly going above and beyond, showing you how we earn our stars to really exceed those expectations and just treat you like you've never been treated before, way above and beyond. And at Sandals, we're not the only ones that think we're the best. Year after year, we've been voted as the world's leading all-inclusive company due to the amenities, due to the innovations, the beach, the pools, all the things that are featured there at our resorts, plus the service. The staff and the service, they all, they're constantly, constantly, like I mentioned, going above and beyond, doing whatever they can to make this the best trip for you um, each and every day. 
So at Sandals, we are uh, couples only and adults only, and we do really emphasize romance. We are for two people in love on the resorts. Uh, so you won't see any kids 18 and older, but like I said, we really do emphasize romance for people of all ages down on at any of our resorts. And we have some of the most spectacular suites there in the Caribbean, our Love Nest Suites. And these are some of the suites that the agents at Covington Travel can actually plan for you. So what, whether you want an ocean view, a beachfront view, your own private pool up in the mountains, or maybe your own private pool right outside of your balcony area, agents can set that up for you and put you in that perfect destination in that perfect location uh, for your stay. And then we move to our spa style bathrooms where very exotic, very extravagant. We have the tranquility soaking tubs, the backlit mirrors, uh, the walk in shower, the rain shower, the red lane spa amenity kit, because we really want you to feel like you're in a spa in your own bathroom. So at Sandals, we have three main levels of service, but I'm going to touch on our top two here. So Club Sandals is actually our middle tier. So once you arrive and you're staying in one of our club sandal suites, you're greeted at the front. You're greeted with a nice, cool, refreshing lemongrass scented towel. As soon as you get off the shuttle, uh, as you walk to the club sandals lounge, you're greeted with a nice glass of champagne, maybe a cocktail if you would like. And there at club sandals, they can take care of any of your dinner reservations. Uh, you do have the tw uh, you do have the room service from about 7 a.m. to 10 p.m. And you do have the stocked in room liquor and the stocked in room bar uh, that's constantly restocked each and every day. So your rum, your vodka, your gin, your whiskey, once again, constantly restocked. Then we have our Butler Elite program. This is the top of the top of the best of the best. Because once you arrive at any of our resorts and you're staying in our butler suites, the butler greets you as soon as you arrive. They go through a nice little private check-in with you in your own room where they can prepare any of your dinner reservations. More and more of our restaurants are requiring reservations in the post-COVID world just so we can make sure that we have everybody spaced out. So the butlers can take care of that for you as soon as you arrive. They're, they actually do give you your own private cell phone. And with that cell phone, you can call the butler at any time while you're on the resort. If you're down on the beach and you could go, if you're down on the beach and could go for uh, some nachos, or if you wanted to move chairs or you wanted them to set up your beach chairs, you can call up the butler and they can uh, get that and do that for you. They're right there at your own fingertips where you can call them at any time uh, throughout your stay. With the butler, you also do have 24 hour room service. So if you wanted that very early morning breakfast, or that late night uh, extra meal, you could do so and order that from the butlers. And with the butlers, you also have the stocked in-room bar. It's going to be the higher level. So the absolute vodka, the Tanqueray gin. Now, all of our rooms come with a stocked mini fridge full of juices, sodas, waters, beer, and wine. And then with the butler and the club level, you do have the stocked in-room bar. Now, at Sandals, we're not just about the beach and those amazing suites that you saw beforehand. We have some of the most captivating pools located there in the Caribbean. Our zero entry pools, our active pools, our swim up pools. Um, we have our laid back pools and then we do have the swim up pool bars. And you can actually thank us for the swim up pool bars, but the one unique feature about all of our pools is that they never close. They're open 24 hours all throughout the day, all throughout the evening. So if you wanted that late night swim, you could easily do so. Um, at any of our pools. Now at Sandals, I always like to say you can wake up and sit on the beach for the entire day. Spend your entire time on the beach, relax and sit back, or you can be as active as you would like. All of our land sports and all of our water sports are already included there for you. So feel free to go paddle boarding, hubby cat sailing, tubing, water skiing, wakeboarding, any of those options. For snorkeling, we actually offer snorkeling excursions. We send you out on one of our dive boats. We send you out into the water. We give you the gear to actually, so you can go and experience and see some of those amazing reefs out in the water. If you're a scuba diver, we do offer scuba diving already that's included. You get two dives a day. Um, and if you've never been before, it's a $100 charge. And then you can go out diving each and every day afterwards if you would like. We go through a nice little uh, on resort orientation for you to walk you through the steps and then you can actually go out diving as well 
And when it comes to our land sports, the beach volleyball, the pool volleyball, billiards, basketball, tennis, golf, we have four golf courses where we offer complimentary greens fees. So as I mentioned before, at any of our resorts, you can be as active as you want or do absolutely nothing and lay across the beach there. So when you go to any of our resorts, we want you to actually go and experience the island itself. And that's where we have Island Roots, which is our excursion company. So with Island Roots, you can go and talk with the agents there at Covington Travel. They can plan this ahead of time for you. Because when you go to Jamaica, we want you to go to Rick's Cafe. We want you to go to Duns River Falls. We want you to take advantage of the Catamaran Cruise um, or go to the Appleton Rum Tour down in the South Coast area and experience the island and immerse yourself in that culture there. So feel free to reach out to the agents beforehand and they can book that for you. Now, I couldn't talk about Sandals being the only five-star luxury included resort without touching on our five-star global gourmet dining. And here we have over 26 dining cuisines to choose from. And we want you to dine around the world. We want you to experience all those different flavors. So go to our French restaurant, have your appetizer, have your entree, stand up, walk out, go to our Italian restaurant, have another appetizer, have another entree, maybe have a dessert if you would like. Experience those different flavors and try those different options because there's no upcharge at any of our restaurants and there's no additional cost. And here at our restaurants, we bring the freshest fruits, the freshest veg vegetables. Our chefs actually walk up and down the farms to pick out those fresh, those fresh ingredients for you to go right from the farm to the table there. So you're guaranteed to always have the best ingredients at any of our restaurants. And with our five-star premium liquors at any of the bars that we have across our resorts, you can get those top shelf drinks. So it's the uh, the Jack Daniels, the Johnny Walker, the Maker's Mark, the Tito's, the Tanqueray, the Bombay, uh, the Don Julio, all of the top shelf liquors that we already have there. And that's at all of our bars. So no matter what room level, room category you're staying in, you have the opportunity to experience all of our amazing drinks. Now at Sandals, it's always a party. It's always a party. We always have the... Uh, the entertainment going, whether it's our Jamaican beach parties, our reggae parties, our white night parties where we serve the chocolate buffet, there's always some form of entertainment happening each and every night. Now that I talked to you about the Sandals experience and what you can get by going to any of our resorts, I'm going to walk you through our 15 different Sandals resorts that we have. But before I did that, I did want to touch on the post-COVID world because Everything that I mentioned before, all of the activities, all of the inclusions, that is still happening today. We have not halted any of our operations on the resort, the water sports, the land sports, all of the restaurants, all of the drinks, all of the bars, all of the entertainment is still happening today. So you are getting that full vacation no matter when you do travel. So now as we make our way over to uh, the different resorts, we do are featured on six beautiful islands there in the Caribbean, the Bahamas, Jamaica, St. Lucia, Grenada, Antigua, and Barbados. And we do have 15 different resorts. And currently right now, Jamaica, St. Lucia, Grenada, Antigua, and Barbados are all open. All of those islands are currently open right now with some of our resorts. Um, so if you were interested, you could go down there tomorrow even. So the first island we're going to look at is the island of Jamaica there, and we're going to head to the Montego Bay area. Uh, we're here in Jamaica. We do feature six of our Sandals resorts. But here in Montego Bay, as soon as you arrive on the island, after it's right next – the resort itself, it's right next to the airport. So within arriving to the island, within 15 to 20 minutes after going through customs, after going through immigration, you're sitting on the largest private white sand beach there in the Caribbean. You have the, the butler that you already called that's maybe grabbing you some of the jerk chicken from the jerk shack. You have the rum punch that's already in your hand, and you're sitting on that beach, and you're already enjoying your vacation. Sandals Montego Bay, it's fairly active, but we do have some areas across the resort that are a lot more laid back. You can see our beautiful swim-up Crystal Lagoon Suites where you have that access right outside of your bedroom and in some of the room uh, rooms blocks, we do have those beautiful Montego Bay uh, blue waters in the background. 
Here at Montego Bay, we feature 11 different dining options to choose from. Out of those 11 options are soy. It's our sushi restaurant. Go here. Have the uh, the nice sushi roll, maybe the, the shrimp tempura, and then head over to Butcher Steak and Seafood where you can get our New York-style Wagyu steak, the New York-style steakhouse, once again, at no additional cost here for you. At San Jose Montego Bay, we do have our Latitudes, which is our over-the-water bar. The over-the-water bar, we have the hammocks surrounding it. It's a perfect area for during the day, during the evening. If you wanted that cocktail before dinner, go go there. Our bartenders, I like to call them mixologists, they always make it a fun experience here. They're interacting. They're putting drinks on their heads. They're serving drinks in different ways. They're always having uh, – it's always a fun experience here at the over-the-water bar. So now we're going to make our way over to Sandals Royal Caribbean. And Sandals Royal Caribbean sits about five minutes from Sandals Montego Bay, where we do actually offer, where we do actually offer exchange privileges between the two resorts. And here at Sandals Royal Caribbean, once you step foot on the resort, it has that very British style feel. You have the uh, the nice cove style beaches, which are a little bit smaller, a little bit more intimate. But then as you make your way through, you see our beautiful offshore island there where we have our swimming pool bar. Um, we have two of our restaurants. And then, of course, as you can see, our over the water suites. Our over the water suites are um, 12 over-the-water bungalows, uh, 1,200 square feet, glass bottom floor, tranquility soaking, the tub, soaking tub, over-the-water hammock, and then our five over-the-water villas. The five over-the-water villas, 1,800 square feet, infinity edge pool, over-the-water hammock, two glass bottom floors, floating bed, all right there for you in Jamaica. Just a quick three and a half hour flight from here in Virginia, and you're there in Jamaica. You're there experiencing. See, we even have the butler waiting for you right there with a couple glasses of champagne across that large glass bottom floor there with the tranquility soaking tub, just a few steps. But imagine waking up to that view every single morning. I'd never want to leave. I'd be there every, every, uh, I'd, I'd never leave. So here at Sandals World Caribbean, we do feature 10 different dining options. Our spices is that Caribbean cuisine that you can get, that authentic style, then our Bombay Club. And our Bombay Club serves our Indian-style cuisine, and it is that authentic feel because we want you to actually feel like you are in India there when you're enjoying our Indian um, restaurant. So now we're going to make our way over to the southern coast of Jamaica at Sandals South Coast. It sits about an hour, hour 15 from the Montego Bay Airport right over the mountains there. And here at Sandals South, South Coast, it's a truly isolated resort. So there's nothing to the left and there's nothing to the right. It's a perfect, get, perfect getaway. Right now, all of the rooms are beachfront. We have three main villages. So no matter which room you're staying in, you can walk outside to your, to your patio area, maybe to your balcony, and you're sitting there on that beautiful two and a half st uh, stretch mile of beach on the sexy southern coast of Jamaica there. Now, Sandals South Coast, we do have our 12 over-the-water bungalows, similar to those at Sandals Royal Caribbean, with the glass bottom floor, the tranquility soaking tub, and the over-the-water hammock with the king-size bed right there overlooking the southern coast of Jamaica. Now, Sandals South Coast features nine different dining options to choose from. And here, out of those nine, many of them sit very close to each other. So it's easy to dine around, to go to one, go to a second, maybe go to a third, and experience all those different flavors all in one evening if you would like. So now we're going to make our way over to the Negril area at Sandals Negril. It sits about an hour 15, hour and a half from the Montego Bay Airport. We have the world's famous Rick's Cafe, which is just a few minutes away. If you wanted to watch any of the locals jump off the cliffs, if you wanted to jump off the cliffs, you could easily do so there. At Rick's Cafe. Now here at Sandals and the Grill, it's your true beach lovers resort. All of the rooms sit just a few steps from one of the best stretches of Negril's Seven Mile Beach. The water is glass. It is, it is as flat as glass. I never see the large waves here. Perfect for any of those water sports. Perfect for taking a stroll, an evening stroll, all across the beach there um, on that beautiful Seven Mile Beach. 
Now here we have one of our two story, one bedroom butler loft suites. Now these rooms, the bedrooms are actually up a little bit higher on the resort. So the night's winding down, you grab a cocktail before you head to dinner. Maybe you have a cup of the Jamaican Blue Mountain coffee and you're sitting out there on your balcony and you're seeing the beautiful Negril sunsets. Because not only is Negril all about the beach, but it's all about those beautiful, stunning sunsets that you get every single, uh, every single evening. Now, out of the seven dining options that we do have here at Sandals and the Grill, six of them sit right along the beach. So it really is your true beach lover's paradise here at Sandals and the Grill. So now we're going to make our way over to the Ocho Rios area where we, ha um, we have two resorts. They sit about an hour and a half from the Montego Bay Airport, right along that smooth coastal highway there um, at the northern part of the island. Now here uh, in Ocho Rios, we'll take a look at Sandals Royal Plantation. Now Sandals Royal Plantation, this is our only all butler boutique style resort. It's very elegant, very intimate, very pristine here. It's just sort of very private uh, beach there in Jamaica, um, very quiet, but this is where our butlers take that next step. I've actually seen some guests walking around the beach here, and then once they sat in their beach chairs, just a few, mo few moments later, a butler walked up to them and brushed the sand off their feet. That's the level of service we provide here at Sandals Royal Plantation. Every room is oceanfront, so every room gives you the opportunity to wake up. And you see the elegant four-poster bed, but you have that nice balcony there. You have that nice view of the beautiful ocean there in, uh, in Ocho Rios. And there we already have the butler preparing a nice candlelight dinner for you in the evening right outside of your room. Now at Sandals Royal Plantation, we do feature five dining options to choose from. But with 75 rooms and five dining options, there's plenty of availability and plenty of space um, each and every night. But by staying at Sandals Royal Plantation, you do have access to Sandals Ochi Beach. We do offer a shuttle service that can take you from Royal Plantation over to Ochi. It's about a two-minute shuttle ride, but here at Sandals Ochi, you get the full experience. You get the total experience. It's 530 rooms. It's our largest resort. Um, half of the uh, rooms will sit up on the mountainside, uh, hidden away in the lush tropical, uh, the mountains, and the other half will be right there, right there down on the beachfront side, um, just a few steps from that beach. Now here at Sandals Ochi, you can see some of our more private pool uh, suites tucked away in the mountainside. And some of these pools, they're semi-private, so you might have to share them with others, but then you could have your own private pool there in our Romeo and Juliet suite on the left-hand side. The living room on the one side, the bedroom on the other, and your own private pool right in the middle of the room. Now, Sandals Ochi here, we do feature 16 different dining options. And no matter where you're staying, whether it's on the mountainside or on the beach side, there's always something available. So you really can't go hungry here at Sandals Ochi Beach. You're not allowed to go hungry here because there's so many different choices to choose from. Now, Sandals Ochi, it is our party resort. So we bring in the mechanical bull. We have the, uh, the reggae parties. We have our Jamaican beach parties. But then we do have the rabbit hole. Now, the rabbit hole is the Caribbean's first speakeasy bar where you do need a password to get in. Now, all the staff members know the password and they'll easily give it to you, but it takes you back to those prohibition days. The Moscow Mules, the Electric Lemonade, Big Mama, she's our performer in there, has one of the most beautiful voices I've ever heard. She's always putting on a show. So whether you're staying here at Sandals Ochi or if you're staying at Sandals Royal Plantation, you have to make your way over to the rabbit hole and experience that uh, one-of-a-kind speakeasy bar. So now we're going to make our way over to the Bahamas. So the two, we do uh, here in the Bahamas, we do feature two resorts, one in Nassau and one in the Great Exumas, Sandals Royal Bahamian and Sandals Emerald Bay. So first we'll take a look at our one resort there in Nassau, Sandals Royal Bahamian. It's a very sophisticated European style resort. So once you arrive, you have that European architecture and we have our two large, um, large buildings on the left and the right hand side with a royal um, Royal English Village tucked away in the back there, um, but here at Sandals Royal Bahamian, each of those uh, each of those 
large buildings there. They do have their own pool. One's a little bit more active. One's a little bit more uh, quiet and laid back here at Royal Bahamian. Now, at Santa's Royal Bahamian, we do feature our offshore island. Our offshore island, which has plenty of different cabanas, plenty of seating areas, a nice swim-up pool bar. One of our 10 dining options is there, and plenty of beach space as well. So if you really wanted to socially distance yourself and get away from everyone, you could easily do so at our offshore island. There is plenty of space there. So now we're going to make our way over to Sandals Emerald Bay. Uh, it's a very sophisticated resort, very exquisite resort on the outer islands of the Bahamas. Here at Sandals Emerald Bay, it's much more laid back. You get your true R&R rest and relaxation here at this resort. It's very spread out, but I can say as a guarantee, Sandals Emerald Bay has the bluest water in the Caribbean. The bluest water. I've never seen anything like it. And with the white sand there, the comparison and the co contrast is unbelievable. Now here at Sandals Emerald Bay, we do have many of our beachfront suites where with this resort being so spread out, when you walk outside of your room and you're right there on the beach, it almost feels like there is nobody else there on the beach with you. We have the beach chairs, we have the umbrellas, but it's so spread out that it almost feels like you are the only one currently on the beach there. It's perfect for the, uh, the social distance here at Sandals Emerald Bay. And for our golf courses, we do have our one golf course here, our championship Greg Norman designed 18 hole golf course right here at Sandals Emerald Bay. And it's right there on the resort. So you don't have to worry about a shuttle. Six beautiful, stunning signature holes right along the water. You can see one of the popular holes on the left-hand side there, right on the edge of the peninsula in the water there. Uh, even if you're not a golfer, you have to take the chance to walk the resort or walk the course and see some of those amazing views. Now, before I move to the Eastern Caribbean, I know we had a question on uh, the rabbit hole. The capacity for the rabbit hole as of right now, I do not know what the full capacity is, um, but I've never even I've never seen it completely packed um, all at one time before. It does have there are plenty of seating areas and plenty of space there at, uh, at Ochi. So now we're going to make our way over to the Eastern Caribbean. And here at the Eastern Caribbean, we're located on four beautiful, stunning islands, Antigua, St. Lucia, Grenada, and Barbados. And first, we'll take a look at the island of Antigua. So Antigua, it's a very historic island. There are a lot of excursions and not a lot of national landmarks that spread throughout the island where you actually can take some of those historic uh, excursions to actually go and see some of those amazing um moments and landmarks there and sandals granite or sandals antigua or the island of antigua pardon me is known to have 365 beaches one beach for each day of the year now sandals i said it before we're the best so we're going to sit on the best beach there uh dickinson bay at the most northern part of the island up in the saint john's area now sandals grand antigua was actually voted as the world's most romantic resort so you are actually required to love each other when you come to Sandals Grand Antigua. It's not a question and it's not an option. You're required to love each other. Now here at Sandals Grand Antigua, we have two main villages, our Caribbean village on the left-hand side there, right along the beachfront area, you're that seaside garden oasis with your low-rise buildings. And on the right-hand side, our Mediterranean village, tucked away in the back with the opportunity to see the entire resort, that high rise buildings from up in the top. You have the beautiful view of the ocean and the beautiful view of the entire resort itself. And here, one of our top suites in um, the Mediterranean village, you do have the private pool there and the nice private jacuzzi, but you can see that authentic Caribbean style that we have down here at San Luis Grand Antigua. So now we're gonna make our way over to St. Lucia. And here in St. Lucia, St. Lucia has actually been known as the Caribbean's Hawaii because of the active volcano, the national, uh, or the, the waterfalls that we have, the mountains, the, the tropical feel that you get when you arrive to St. Lucia. And we are offering a full exchange privileges, stay at one, play at all between all three of them. We do feature three resorts located at the northern part of the island, about an hour 
hour and a half from the airport there at the southern part of the island. And we do typically offer the full exchange privileges. Right now, it is on hold where we're not allowing the exchange privileges, but down the road, we're looking to uh, start that back up again. So the first island we will look at, or the first resort we will look at here is Sandals Grand St. Lucian. This is our more active, our most active resort out of the three here in St. Lucia. It sits on its own peninsula. So you have the ocean on the one side, the bay on the opposite side, and all the activity comes together there in that main central pool area. We have the white sand, the very calm waters there in the bay, where we do have some of our over-the-water restaurants uh, as well. In the back, Pigeon Peak is one of our national landmarks, uh, or the national park, that you can actually hike up if you wanted to. So this area of the resort and this resort is also a little bit more active. Here at Sandals Grand St. Lucian, we do have the nine over-the-water bungalows. So similar to those in Jamaica, we brought them over here. The St. Lucia, the glass bottom floors, the king size bed, the tranquility soaking tub, and the over the water hammock, perfect there in St. Lucia if you wanted to change up the locations. So then we're going to head over to Sandals Regency Latoc. Sandals Regency Latoc. This is our most glamorous resort. It's a little active, but a little quiet at the same time, where we have Half of the rooms will sit down on the Emerald Village, closer to the beach there, just a few steps from the beach. Uh, we can see the butler bringing some nice drinks there for that couple relaxing on the beach. But the other half of our rooms will sit up on the bluff. And you can hear the waves crashing against the rocks. The water here is a little bit more rough, but still nothing, nothing too dangerous. But there up on the bluff, you have some of the best views in the Caribbean. Sandals Region Silatak, it's known as the most glamorous resort because it has the best views. It's also known for its views. Here we have our millionaire suite. Where imagine, you wake up in the morning, you open that view, and you have a full 180 degree view of those magnificent St. Lucian waters. And if the bed wasn't enough, you can hop into the pool. And if you weren't happy with the pool, we have the seating area, uh, the nice little couch area there that you can see. So, so many different areas take in those beautiful views each and every day for you. Or you can relax in that tranquility soaking tub as well. Now, at Sandals Region Seal Talk, we feature nine different dining options. Half of them will be up on the bluff and the other half will be down at the Emerald Village on the beachfront area. So, no matter where you're staying, there's always a dining option and there's always something available. So as we make our way over to Sandals Halcyon now, this is our smallest resort here in St. Lucia. We call it the Garden of Eden. A lot of meandering pathways. It's very lush. It's very tropical. There's actually no building as tall as the highest palm tree. So your low-rise buildings, your cottage-type style rooms, but we do have the largest river lagoon there in the Caribbean. That meanders through the back area of the resort, but we do offer some of our swim-up suites. Here, here you can see our cottage type style suite um, with a nice private plunge pool out on the front area there with the king size bed, but it is a little bit more hidden. The best word I use to, to describe Sandals Halcyon is cozy. It gives that cozy type of feel when you're here, when you're walking around the resort. Um, the staff get to know you instantly after only being here a few days. <clears throat> Halcyon features seven different dining options. And Kelly's Dockside and Kimonos are two of our more popular ones, the Japanese tempanyaki style from Kimonos. And Kelly's Dockside, the over-the-water restaurant, uh, where we have the glass windows, where you can actually feel like you're over the water while you're dining there each and every day. So as we make our way over to Grenada now, Grenada is a very exotic island. Not many people have heard of it there. Uh, perfect for scuba diving. We have a lot of amazing dive sites here, our underwater museums, the sunken slave ships that we feature. Um, but it's also known as the Spice Island. Grenada has some amazing spices, some amazing blends that they use throughout all of the restaurants and throughout all of their different foods. So if you're a true foodie, this is the perfect resort and perfect destination for you. Now, the resort itself sits about two and a half minutes from the airport there. So within just a few minutes, you're sitting on that pink gin beach. You run your hands through the sand, and you can actually see 
those pink particles and see why we call it the pink gin beach. Sandals Grenade, it's a fairly a little bit more active where we have our three main villages. But no matter where you want what where you want to be, there's always something for you. If you wanted to be right up in the front and stay in one of our sky pool suites with your own infinity edge pool in the Italian village, up on the third, four, fourth, or fifth floor of the building, you have that infinity edge pool. You open up those curtains, open up those doors, and you're overlooking the resort there. You could see those waters right on the opposite side. But if you wanted something a little bit more private, back in the South Seas Village, we have our private pool suites with the jacuzzi. And once again, the butler. That's not always standing there. There's not always a butler standing there. But remember, you do have the private cell phone that you can call them at any time to bring you some towels, some drinks, some food, so you can really enjoy the time together there in your private suite. So I mentioned that Sandals Grenada, or in the island of Grenada, was known as the Spice Island. They actually have a nutmeg ice cream here in Grenada that is to die for. It's unbelievable. I know people that have had it for breakfast, lunch, and dinner in some way, shape, or form when they've been down here. It's that great. So when you come to Grenada, that's the first step you have to do. When you check in, ask them about the nutmeg ice cream, and they'll point you to the right in the right direction. So as we make our way, last but not least, to the island of Barbados. So here in Barbados, we have two resorts, and it's two times the fun because there's no shuttle to take you back and forth. There's no wristband. There's no checking in one or checking out of the other. They are right next to each other, so it's full exchange privileges. You can just walk back and forth between the two resorts because, once again, they are right next to each other. So we sit at the uh, southern part of the island there, right by the St. Lawrence Gap. Now, Sandals Barbados was actually the first adults-only, couples-only, all-inclusive brought to the island of Barbados. We sit on the renowned Dover Beach, very spacious, very large stretch of beach there with line by the, the palm trees there. And Sandals Barbados, it's a very compact type of resort. It very much accentuates the best part of nature. We have the palm tree spread throughout the middle there. And then we have the crystal lagoon that floats throughout the back end and the sides of the resort. So you have some many of your swim up crystal lagoon suites, but you're right in the middle of the, uh, that feeling of nature and that lush tropical garden. Now here at Sandals Barbados, we do feature 11 different dining options to choose from. Our Bombay Club, the Indian Cuisine, and then our Butch's Chop House. But because the two resorts are right next to each other, I don't like separating them. In my opinion, you have 18 restaurants to choose from between the two because you can walk back and forth. So then as we make our way right across the, uh, the little, little road there to Sandals World Barbados, you can see our most exclusive, all-inclusive that we've ever had. Our, main, our Infinity Edge rooftop pool right there on our, the sixth floor of one of our buildings. Just a few steps to the side, you have your rooftop uh, Infinity, Infinity Edge jacuzzi, and we have our sky bar. This area of the resort is a little bit more laid back. We're playing the soothing songs, the, the easy music up here. But then we have our main Infinity Edge pool. With the bar on the, uh, on the right-hand side there, that in large Infinity Edge glass just a few steps from the beach. Now, this part of the resort is a little bit more active. We have the music going here. A lot of people get together here in the main pool at Royal Barbados. Our Sky Pool Suites, uh, we love them so much in Grenada, we brought them over here to Barbados. And they're right on the beachfront there. And there's no palm trees blocking these rooms. You have a full, unobstructed view of the water right from outside in your Infinity Edge Pool. And if you wanted something a little bit more closer to all the action, we have the Crystal Lagoon Swim Up Suites with that Tranquility Soaking Tub on the outside area there. And we did include the privacy curtains because, as I, we always say, what happens at Sandals stays at Sandals and then makes its way over to beaches. So here at Sandals Royal Barbados, we do have six different dining options to choose from. Our La Parisienne is our rooftop, infin uh, our rooftop restaurant, our French cuisine. As you can see, you can dine on the outside area there. And in the evening when all the lights are lit up, uh, it's a beautiful and stunning view of the entire resort. And our entertainment lounge and our entertainment lobby on the left-hand side is where we feature our four-lane bowling alley. 
our Lover's Lane Bowling Alley, four lanes. So whether you're staying there at Sandals Royal Barbados or at Sandals Barbados, you can experience our bowling alley. And there at our, uh, in our Lover's Lane, we have our Lover's Lane Bar, serving 18 world beers from all across different countries. Jamaican beers, your Canadian beers, your German, your American beers, the Italian, um, your French beers, all of the different uh, types. And we have that frosted glass that can keep them cool uh, while, while you're sitting there taking the time to drink them. So all of the features that I mentioned at, at our Sandals Resorts, the land sports, the water sports, the activities, the food, uh, the drinks, we also have at Beaches. And Beaches is for everybody. Families, friends, singles, kids, couples, anybody can go to our beaches resort. And it's not just the beach vacation. It's that full luxury included family vacation. Because we do have the water parks. We do have the kids camps. We're partnered with Sesame Street. So we have the activities there and the characters uh, walking around. We have the Xbox One play lounge, the trench town where the kids get together. Uh, we have the mac and cheese food truck the frozen yogurt uh, shop, the crepery areas, all of the main pools, the kids' swim-up bars. So whether the child is, if they're not a beach person, it's not a problem. We have plenty of different activities for them as well. And we currently have three beaches resorts. We're located in, um, in Jamaica at Beaches in the Grill and Beaches Ocho Rios. And then we have Beaches Turks and Caicos located in the Providentialis area. Turks and Caicos there. So, for coming out this, this morning, turning into afternoon now, we're getting close. Um, we are offering a wonderful incentive for all of you. So, for coming out, if you happen to place a deposit for a future trip within the next two weeks, if you're staying six nights or longer in a club level or a butler level suite, you can choose one of the following four options. It can be a $250 spa credit at any of our sandals or beaches resorts. And for that, you can use um, for a nice couple's massage. Maybe uh, you can use that all for yourself to do a massage if you really needed some pampering, however you wanted to split it up. You can do a $250 combo credit, which is $100 towards the spa, $100 towards a private candlelight dinner, and $50 towards the photo shop a $250 scuba program credit. If you've never been scuba diving and wanted to take advantage of the program we have on the resort. And last but not least, you can take advantage of our catamaran cruise at either Jamaica or Turks and Caicos. On top of that, we have our 777 promotion where we have seven rooms across seven different resorts that are, uh, that are offering an additional 7% off. And the agents there at Covington Travel, they know the different rooms. So if you have any questions about that, they can give you some more information. And we just announced yesterday our Veterans Day sale going from November 4th to November 13th. If you book six nights or longer and any of our resorts at any room category, we're offering a $250 spot credit. So you could take, if you book until since, until November 13th for a resort in Jamaica, you can get a catamaran cruise and a $250 spot credit. You can combine these and the agents at Covington Travel, they can work with you and get you the best deal and the best pricing and the best opportunity. So I wanted to thank you all for coming out. Now's the time to start looking. Now's the time to start planning because the availability is going. The availability is coming. Things are getting easier. The resorts are opening up opening up we've opened 12 out of our 18 resorts with more opening in the future these next few weeks so let's make those dreams that we've had for so long and especially these last couple months let's make them into memories let's make them happen let's make that future happen and hold out the hope so i'm going to pass it over back now to beverly thank you very much ryan oh my goodness I am totally struck by the number of dining options at all of these places. It's crazy. Can you hear me okay? Okay, Ryan can't hear me, I don't think. 
Uh, do we have any questions from anybody else? Any questions? Uh, you can type them in the chat box. I've got all the mics open also. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us today. When you're ready to uh, take a sandals or a family beaches vacation, our Covington advisors are ready to help you do that. Um, you can reach us by any of the uh, social media or website or phone number on your screen there. And we really look forward to speaking with you soon. Thank you so much for coming out. Y'all have a good day. Stay safe.